Hi, this is a webinar on the grading options in the Setup tab in the ThinkWave system. First, click on the Setup tab. This is where you'll find the options for the grading within the ThinkWave system. Click on the school's final grade scales. Here you can add a custom grading scale. To add a grading scale, click the Add Grade Scale link at the top left. Here you can add a name, like for kindergarten. Once you add a custom grading scale, it'll appear below the default letter grades. You can add grades by clicking Add Grade beneath the custom grade scales. And here you can add the grade, like Very Good. And here you can add the description. Here is where you can select whether the grade earns credits. And here you can select whether it's included in the GPA. Here's where you enter the GPA value, and here's the value for the honors GPA. And here are the minimum percent needed for the student to earn this grade. This is affected by the rounding options, which I'll get to in a moment. The letter grades here are the default in the ThinkWave system. You can edit the default existing grades by clicking the grade on the left, or at the edit icon on the right and you can delete the grade by clicking the Delete button on the top right. Once the grades are created, you can assign the grades to the classes by going to the Classes tab and selecting the grade from the pull-down menu. Going back to the Setup tab and the Final Grade Scales. Here's the non-calculated grades, which can be used as part of the default scale, or any custom grade scales that you create. To include a percent-based final grade in the GPA, you have to enable this feature by clicking the Enable button. Click on the Minimum Percent or the Edit icon to edit the GPA scale. Here you can select the Minimum Percent to achieve that GPA. And here is where you put the value of the GPA, and here is the Honors GPA value. If you want to add additional values, you can click Add Percent here. And then you have to add something like a minimum percent of 95 will earn you a 4.2 in the GPA or a 5.2 in the honors GPA. Going back to the school's final grade scales. Here you can select either letter grades or percent for the grade type for newly created classes. Here you can select how many places a final grade will round to get to the letter grade. You can select zero to three places. For instance, if you are rounding to a whole digit, you may want to set the minimum percent to 89.5% to have the rounding match what the percentage displays. And here are the minimum percent required to earn a credit when the final grade is a percent. Now back to the Setup tab. Now go to Standards and Skills. Here's where you can add or edit the graded standards and skills. Click Add to add standards and skills. Here you can enter the name, and here you can choose to exclude it from report cards and transcripts. You can edit or delete an existing standards and skills by clicking on it. You can delete it by clicking the delete icon at the top right. Once you have all the standards and skills here, you can add them to individual classes by going to the Classes tab. Select the class from the left menu, then click the edit icon next to standards and skills at the bottom. You can select them here, You can go back and organize them by dragging and dropping. And these are the options available for the grading in the ThinkWave system. Thanks for watching.